In this video I'm going to show you how you can set up a guest network on the Netgear D7000 router. So to do this we need to get into the router settings so use any kind of web browser you want to. I'm going to be using Firefox for this demonstration. You can also use Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge and so on. So once you open up your browser you need to type in the address so to get into this particular router you have to type in routerlogin.net and then you'll be asked to enter your password and so on if you haven't kind of set up a password and it's usually just admin and so on so once you're into the main um, interface what you need to do is to select basic which is by default and then down the bottom you can see here guest network so once that loads so a guest network is basically you know if you want to allow guests within your home to log into your Wi-Fi or perhaps even allow your neighbors to use it if, if they're within the kind of Wi-Fi range. So with this particular um, router, it allows you to set a guest network for both the 2.4 and 5 gigahertz band. With 2.4, you will get better Wi-Fi range, but you will get more interference from certain applications within the home. With 5 gigahertz, you'll get a shorter range, but it's um, less likely to receive interference from home gadgets and so on. So choose which other one you want. You can enable both if you want to, or just one. So for this demonstration, I'm just going to focus on the 2.4. So what you need to do is put a little tick in the box here, enable guest network. By default, the enable SSID broadcast, which is the name of the router. You can see here the name. So you can name this anything you want. Just leave it as Netgear Guest if you want to, or you can type type in you know my home. So then you can set a password or you can just leave it a password off. Personally, I wouldn't um, do that as other people will be able to use it. So select the password, so select the middle one, WPA2-PSK. And then you can enter a password. Now, you can put any kind of password you like, keep it simple or complex. Personally, I keep it simple, so I'll say home 2901. So just put in a password you can remember so once that's all done, click apply. The router then will go through a process of adding the guest network. Okay, so when that's done, it will ask you for your uh, password again. So just click OK, just to make sure everything's working. So now the screen has reloaded and hopefully my guest network, which is called my home, will be available. So as normal, you just click on your little Wi-Fi settings down here on the taskbar. And hopefully we should see my Wi-Fi. There it is there, my home. So basically I just select that, select connect, enter the password and basically you're good to go. So just remember make sure you know your password and just enter any kind of ID you want and just you're good to go you can give that to your friends or guests and so on so basically that's how you do it thanks for watching